Thank you very much, Natalie Merchant. We'll be hearing from, more from her later and her new LP, Ophelia. But now, let's please welcome Huey from the Fun Loving Criminals. <laughs> they love you. I love you. Your group loves you. I want to hear, in fact, well, we'll hear about the group in a moment. But first of all, as it's before, I said that over there, the, uh, the Afghans, they've got that uh, backdrop with the, with the sort of uh, spaceman there. Mm -hmm. the, the question we need answered is, when did man first walk on the moon? Uh, you know, I have very few moments of clarity, but I think it's 1968. 68? There's a man over there that says 69. I'm not sure. How big is he? Probably as big as the moon. <laughs> but it's two of us. And a so, piano. OK. Well, uh, perhaps, if, a lot, if any of the viewers out there know the answer to that, don't bother writing in, just check it up and, uh, and, and, and learn it to yourself. Now, what I want to know is this. When did the Fun Loving Criminals first get together? What was, how, what was, how did you all sort of meet? Uh, we were all working at a club called The Limelight in New York, and uh, we kind of just got together because we all needed a place to live. So we all moved in together and fast over there. We had a little sampling keyboard, and we got, a, got really busy with Steve's classic rock CDs and started mixing some stuff up. And, we started playing, a friend of ours was a promoter and she asked us to play her birthday party and we played it and the boss kept us on as like a replacement gig if someone cancelled because we were already on the clock. So just, uh, yeah. What were you doing in the long night club? Were you, what, were you, I was carrying ice. Hey, cool. And what were Elvis doing? Uh, fast as answering the phone and uh, Steve just hung out. He, he, didn't have a he, he was a member, sort yeah. of thing. Yeah, kind of, yeah. <laughs> and what about, well, you've just finished a, a hugely successful tour of England. Tomorrow you're going to go off to uh, France. What do you carry around in your... What essential things do you have to take with you that they, you can't, you know, that, that, you, well, that you can tell us about? <laughs> <laughs> well, uh, I got a toothbrush. Yeah. No, I, we, we, we kind of roll with, like, uh, tunes, and we have a, a ping-pong paddle tennis table that we take with us. What, it folds out? Yeah, we have these occasional invitationals. So whenever we get the ping-pong table out, we do a little ping-pong. It's quite a big thing to carry, isn't it, right? Yeah, yeah. I mean, that's... I mean, talk about oversized luggage, yeah. you know. There we are. You're going to be playing up on the hill for us. Tell us about that song. Uh, it, it's, you know, I'm, I come from... A, I'm a Puerto Rican kid from New York, so it's... Uh, you get a lot of, like, different cultures in New York City, especially where I grew up in downtown, so... This is kind of like my interpretation of Buddhism. We should look forward to hearing that. Yeah. Huey, thank you very much oh, indeed. Thank you. <laughs>